Let me get this out of your way. <coughs> Feed the scale. Okay. Mm -hmm. All right, Tomas. Marco has a very fine, very smooth scale. Okay. Tomas has that good technique. Mm -hmm. Damn, you're like a wizard out here, man. What up, Jerk Squad? We're out here at Huntington Beach, California today. We are at the pier, which is on PCH, Pacific Coast Highway. It is 5 a.m. in the morning, and we're gonna walk down here and we're gonna see what we can catch. All right, I'm about halfway up the pier right now, and I'm looking at the water and it's actually pretty calm. The waves are not as big as they usually are, so we'll see how that plays into effect. All right, Jerk Squad, I got my cooler that I brought out here to keep the little fish in because I want to take home some mackerel or sardines today and I want to cook them and see what they taste like. I've never eaten them before. And then I have my spider wire tackle box backpack and I have my jigging rod that I'm gonna use with my sabiki rig. And then I have my big game fishing rod that I'm gonna use to cast out a uh, bigger bait and see what I can catch. I am using a sabiki rig, which is one of these bad boys. You can get them on the internet, they're really cheap. They're size eight hooks. You want them extra small because these fish have really little mouths. All right, there we go. We got our first bait fish. Now, let's take him off. I'm gonna throw him in the cooler for right now. We got our first fish. There we go, look at him go. All right, here comes that thumbs up for the jerk squad. I turned that little Dane into three separate pieces of bait to put on my bait hook. I have a two ounce slip sinker, a Carolina keeper, a steel leader, and a bait hook. And what I'm gonna do is throw one of these big fillets on here. All right, there we go. We got our setup ready to cast out. Now we're talking. Now we're talking. There we go. Another little Dean. Little baby Dean, that's some good bait right there. In the bucky he go. That's a big dude. Put dude in here. Get him to stop flapping around. There we go. <coughs> Ow, fucker. Ooh. That's a nice dean right there. Alright. We'll take him home and cook him. For sure. Alright, let's hear it. The old school Dr. Dre. Yeah. <laughs> That's awesome, dude. That's awesome. Yeah, no problem at all. Yep. Yeah. Yep, you too, man. I'm sure I'll see you up here again. Alright. Fish number four. I got another another mackerel. Ooh, the top of that one looks sweet. Look at that. Oh yeah, let's see how to clean the fish real quick. Let me get this out of your way. The scale. Okay. Mm -hmm. All right, Tomas. Has a very fine, very small scale. Okay. Tomas has that good technique. Mm -hmm. Damn, you're like a wizard out here, man. All right, so that gets all the scales Both and goo sides. off. And... Yeah. All right, so we scale the fish. Mm -hmm. Then take the feet <clears throat> and run the tail. Cut them. It on the middle bone. Okay. All right, up along the bone and get your fillet off. Mm -hmm. All right, all right. Up yeah. to the head. Yeah. And then cut the fillet out. Damn, that's a perfect fillet. Look at that, Look at that bone. Piece. No that meat. Bone. No meat wasted. And then you can eat that whole thing, right? Of course. Wow. 
Man, this is awesome. Thanks, Tomas. Mm -hmm. Now I'll be able to do it myself. Oh, that color is so cool. It's like purple. Mm. <laughs> wow. You are the master. Of course. Wow. And Look at that. You didn't leave yeah. any meat on there. Yeah. Wow. And, uh, Just the guts and the body. The head and the bone. Oh, by the way. Where is the Do you keep the head? Liver, no. Oh, the liver, right? Mm -hmm. Do you eat the liver? Of course, very. Do you eat it raw? Peaceful. No, no, no. Oh, I was going to say. I'll oh, have to so get that on right. film. <laughs> this one. That's the liver? Mm hmm. All right, all right. So, on some side, on this side, and both sides. This all right. is for the bird. Ah. Give that to the birds? Yeah, All to right. feed the bird. So we keep the meat the and give the rest to the birds. Ah, the rest for the bird. All right, cool, Tomas. Thanks, man. All right, I'm going to go try and catch some more. Yeah. Thanks for showing me, Tomas. A lot of them, I don't think, were friends to begin with. All righty. I caught another guppy. This looks like another one of those Spanish mackerel. I got another mackerel, Tomas. Out here doing work. All right, let's grab this dude. Let's open up the old cooler and we shall put him in, into the cooler. Now we have three mackerel. And I used one of them, or two of them actually, two of them for my big pole. And I might actually have to use another. And finally, my biggest one. That's a big one. got three good fish you, you brought me lunch <laughs> yeah. no I got three ready to cook right here <laughs> I know look at that one though that's a nice one I mean if you don't mind what if I got you a sandwich no that's awesome dude thanks man I'm actually starving you didn't have to do that Damn, thanks, Greg. That's really sweet. <laughs> he says, yeah, I don't fuck around. <laughs> That's awesome, dude. Yeah, thanks. Big time. All right, let's do it, Greg. Thanks, man. You know what? I don't, I don't care what they say about you. You're all right. Damn, dude. This is awesome. Cheers, Greg. Thanks. Man, what a perfect day. Mm. Check this out, Greg. How are these grabbing you? You got the food, I got the beverages. All right, guys. I think that's going to sum up my fishing trip. I got three mackerel. Right here. One, two, three. And I already scaled them and cleaned the guts out, so they're good to go. But this is my view today. This is Huntington Beach at its best. Got Ruby's Diner down here, Surf City Diner. But uh, yeah, I call this the Jerk Master Privilege. Now, speaking of Jerk Master Privilege, it's time to get home and eat these bad boys. So let's do it. I'm back at the crib and I got three little pacific mackerel fillets well they're not fillets it's pretty much almost a whole fish i just cut the head off i took the scales off and i gutted it
We're gonna add red pepper, spice it up a little bit. We're gonna add garlic powder, cause who doesn't like garlic powder? And we're gonna add some black pepper, cause who doesn't like black pepper? Swirl it all around a little bit. And we are going to stick this into the oven. Yeah, we'll put it on top of that tray. Bam. All right, it's time to take these bad boys out of the oven. All right. Damn. Damn. Look at that sizzle on that fish. Oh, that looks so good. I scored them too, just so the flavor goes in and they cook good. And... Oh, man. It's all done, jerk squad. <laughs> All right, let's try this. Oh my. All right, I gotta show you this. This is what I am about to eat. And I think I want to take this bite right here. Ooh, it just falls off the bone. All right, cheers. Mmm. Mmm. That is good. That tastes like any other white pan fish that you can buy from the store. That is excellent. Now, Spanish mackerel is really good to eat because they spawn quick and they grow up really fast. So when you catch them, they're usually really young fish and that means they don't have time to, you know, grow parasites and, you know, develop diseases and all that. So this is a really safe fish to eat. And you can honestly eat fish with like, you know, worms and stuff in them. You just gotta cook them, you know, it's not gonna like hurt you. But don't go eat like infested worm fish and then come back to me like dude I'm fucking dying man but this is amazing this is awesome I suggest this and I've never done this before I really wanted to do this and I literally just went to the pier caught these fish cleaned them brought them home and cooked them it's really easy anyone can do it so you should get out catch your own fish cook it and eat it because it's honestly amazing I'm gonna finish all this Although I always do. Every time I catch fish, I always eat it all. I don't want to waste any. But right now, go down and hit the subscribe button so you can stay up to date on more Perch Jerker videos. And uh, yeah, that's all. I hope you guys enjoy the video. This was a lot of fun. Um, we're going to keep coming at you guys with more videos. Watch this next video that I put at the end of this. It's a good one. You're not going to want to miss it. All right. I'm out, Jerk Squad. This was fun. I'm going to keep making more videos. Hope you guys enjoyed. Don't forget to subscribe. Don't forget. All right. I'll see you guys later. Peace. All right, guys. I'm going north on PCH right now. And you're going to come up to the pier. You're going to hit Main Street. Now, whenever you hit Main Street, you turn right. You're going to go up the strip where all of the restaurants are, Starbucks and everything. Take a left onto Orange Street, is what this road is called. You're gonna come up here, and then right after that big blue sign right there, right here, you got tons of free parking spots. It is 5 a.m. in the morning right now, and no one is up here. But I'm sure by the end of the day, this is going to fill up and there's going to be a lot of people here, so peace.